Hey YouTube, uh, today uh, my video is going to be on uh, some uh, tips and tricks you can do with your Moto 1 action. Uh, the first thing I'm doing when I get a new phone is uh, disabling uh, the apps I won't use. So, going to settings, apps, check all your apps. Chrome, I'm not using this, I'm using uh, Via Browser, it's light and fast. Um, I'm not using Drive from uh, Google too, I'm not using Duo, so disabled. Um, by the way, I'm using uh, Friendly, it's a Facebook app, but uh, lighter, faster, and uh, not using as uh, much... Uh, resources on your phone data or memory or whatever uh, I'm not using Gmail disabled uh, Google Play Movie and Google Play Music I'm not using this so it's been disabled uh, Maps same thing I'm using uh, Waze so uh, just disabling it uh, will uh, save you uh, Resources, um, let's see, photo, again, been disabled, Google Translate, been disabled too, and that's about what I'm not using, so just disable what you're not using. Uh, if you want to clean your phone, uh, one simple and fast uh, app I'm using is Droid Optimizer, uh, yeah, you're gonna say uh, Clean Master, yeah, 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 but mm -hmm. be careful, Clean Master uh, spying on you, and maybe there's some viruses uh, into it to get your personal data, so Droid Optimizer is uh, safe. Uh, starting with uh, Cleanup, Junk Finder, Scan, uh, the big files, I'm not going to touch it, but usually uh, you're going to find some uh, app junk, more junk, old, old APKs, but most of the time it's only uh, app junk. Uh, you can stop background app from here, like three apps were close here. Cleaning the cache, well done. Uh, you uh, can set automatic cleanup. From here you activate it and set the time you want it to uh, run uh, go back <clears throat> you have an app manager you can uh, uninstall the app from here you have a privacy advisor <laughs> Almost all my apps uh, are not secure, so um, you have a one-touch speed up here. Okay, uh, let's see. Want more battery life? Uh, you go to battery. You have the battery saver here. It's gonna save your day. It's turned on. You put it off or on. Um, at 15% here, this is where it's set. It's gonna cut a lot of uh, apps and services, so your phone uh, will uh, save the battery just for making calls, almost. And you can even uh, turn it on by hand like this, so on or off, whatever. Um, adaptive battery. This is something uh, else you can use. Um, okay.
Okay, let's say you're having problem with uh, your cell phone network. Maybe your network is uh, overcrowded. Um, sorry, going to network. Your mobile network. Uh, advanced. You see here it's a preferred uh, network type. It's on LTE. Yeah. I know everybody's on LTE, but if you are having problem, just try 3G. Sometimes uh, it's working. You'll <laughs> maybe be alone on that 3G uh, network, so you're gonna get uh, more speed out of it. Let's put it back to LTE. Uh, okay, let's see. Um, you need to stay up to date. Uh, you want all your apps uh, getting updated automatically. So, you're going to setting of the Google Play Store. Uh, you have auto update, apps. You have over any network, over Wi-Fi only, or don't update apps. And uh, app download preference. You can have on any network, over Wi-Fi only, or ask me every time. If you don't know, um, you can use uh, your uh, fingerprint sensor in the back and swipe it down and you will see notification. Swipe up and it all disappear. Uh, you probably know too that uh, two chop uh, will bring uh, the flashlight up and two twist will uh, bring you up your uh, camera. So if you like what you saw, give it a thumbs up. Uh, maybe you can share it. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. And uh, if you have uh, tips or hints to give about the Moto One action, just uh, leave it on the comment section down below. And thanks for watching.